about just giving, you know, like think about the other person. That that the the best thing I can ask you for this morning, okay? Uh, I'm gonna end up back in Toronto. Yeah, going right around the world almost. system right now 
is, is that we're encouraging people to, uh, to become organ donors by signing a donor card and then expressing the wish to their family. But what happens is, is the decision has to be made at the hospital. Now the family that uh, said yes, in my case, were extraordinary because most families, when they're approached at that moment, will say no because they're in a state of shock and they're in a lot of grief and it's hard for them to think of anything else but the grief that they're in and it's a, a bad system. Uh, so what we're trying to do is put the focus uh, for the decision to be made outside of that. We want to make the decision legal binding uh, and develop a national registry so that we'd be able to register a, ling a legal binding uh, decision uh, in a data bank and that it could be popped up uh, you know, at the hospital in, instead of approaching the family. Now, uh, families that have donated organs have found uh, a lot of comfort in their grieving process knowing that their loved one's uh, organs are, are continuing on and save live, the lives of six, up to ten people actually. You know, one person uh, has the power to save ten people's lives like that. That's awesome when you think about that. So they have the comfort and, and uh, uh, we're actually, uh, along with a shopping list of items that we're bringing to the Prime Minister, we want to develop something else called mutual consent. At present, recipients like myself can't meet the family uh, and there's a lot of donor families that <coughs> want to meet the recipients so what we want to put across is something called mutual consent where there's a, a mutual desire to meet there should be an option available for that meeting to take place because it, it, it uh, would help with closure and completeness and would give the recipient uh, a chance to meet you know their extended family because uh, that's how I feel with the donor family that donated the organ. I feel like I have an extended family out there. Uh, so there's a lot of things like this that, that uh, we're bringing to the attention of not only the public but to the uh, three levels of government. And hopefully we can turn things around and, and be as successful uh, in, 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 in this area as other countries like Spain. Uh, Spain is doing remarkably well in, in their rate. Uh, anybody that goes on the waiting list there has a really good chance of uh, receiving organs because their government embraced the uh, idea and the spirit of organ transplantation when, when they found out it was a cure. And, you know, once upon a time it wasn't a cure. Uh, it was only a short extension on somebody's life uh, because we didn't have the proper drugs. But up uh, until 10 years ago, uh, there's been excellent drugs that, that have been able to uh, not only bring a person's uh, life back, but their healthy life back. Uh, so we have a cure in our hands, and, and our country hasn't embraced that. And we need to because we have 4,000 people right now that are on the waiting list. And, you know, just like myself, I just went for a regular medical checkup uh, eight years ago, and I was told I had something terribly wrong in my blood. All of a sudden, I, I, I have this virus eating up my liver, you know. So uh, anybody could be prone to get an organ disease. So whether it's liver, heart, lung, you know, whatever it is, uh, we, we should try and have a country that has the best system possible. So this is why we're going from community to community and uh, we're, we're trying to get the uh, public's attention and the uh, government's attention. And we've done a lot of universities uh, also. Uh, we found that a good breeding ground sort of thing to, to uh, bring this uh, you know, out, out to the uh, public and, and to bring it into classes to, to uh, uh, you know, do more work on it. As, uh, I know there's been excellent work done in the university when it comes to a lot of other issues, whether they're political, health issues, or whatever. Uh, we feel that this is an issue that should be uh, brought to all the universities uh, right across Canada. So, um, you know, with, with that, I uh, want to thank everybody that, that, that uh, you know, gave us the opportunity to, to present this. And if there's any questions or anything about the walk or 